What is your message to the Labour MPs who have resigned the whip? I'm very glad you've gone. You've been undermining Jerry McCorbyn ever since he came into office. You've done everything you can to discredit him. You haven't managed to do it. You don't feel the same about our policies and what we, the public, want. We want Jeremy as our leader. He's our leader and good riddance, John. We need to get this government out. We need to have a united party and we have got a big party and we've got a broad church in that party. I just feel betrayed, really. I would have liked to have thought that Labour could have been united, especially at this time. And it just goes to show how selfish they really are. I don't understand how they can reconcile their views with each other, how a Tory can be with a, a Labour Party person. They have no concern whatsoever for those they deem below them. They are only concerned about their own careers. They won't be able to go on to the BBC and represent the party anymore. So we'll have Labour representatives representing the party, and that's going to be so much better. It's important to toe the party line, especially for the people that have voted for you, and you should hold a by-election. Those people elected you on a Labour ticket. You were very happy to stand on a Labour ticket on the 2017 manifesto and you need to ask those people again. If you make it impossible for us to get a Labour government, it's a shame on you.